Okay, ladies. All the hoggets are coming. They're coming to join you. So there'll be one big flock of Zvartblas. I've put a touch of food in the troughs so that when I release the hoggets, they'll all come racing down here and stay here long enough for me to catch up and close the gate on them and then open those gates. Okay, girls, you're gonna get company. Come on, dogs, let's go get the hoggets. You're gonna love this, this is your favorite. No. Okay, ladies. It's so mild. And these have grown enough fleece. Yes. Hello, you. Ah, I'm having a hard time opening this gate. It is annoying. There we go. Ebony, right at the exit. I know, Ebony, I'm trying. There we go. Now. Nope. Come on. They're all out. I'm going to put... Hey, 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 you two. No. Leave them be. I'm going to put them out with um, the in lamb yos so they can all have a uh, lovely time outdoors because it is very mild and clear weather, and we're not due to get bad weather till next week. And their fleeces have grown a lot. Woo, they're loving it. Jump, 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 jump. Okay, next stage, through the next set of gates. Hey, girls. Come on, girls. Woo! Come on. Come on. Out of girls. Come on. Come on. Good girls. And you. Now you're not to go and get your head stuck in the fence. Okay. No, no, go on. That way. Good girls. Atta girl, Inca. Get them going. Rindle. Brindle, Brindle, good girl, come back here. There they go. Brindle, Brindle. No, Ebony, don't eat the St. John's wort. Ebony, don't eat the snowdrops. Guys are all eating the snowdrops. There we go. Come on, Woo! Brindle, back here. Hey, 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 hey. There we go. Out a girl. They're all down here now. Inca, you did your job, but you forgot to collect the sheep, the hoggets. You just were concentrating on the alpaca. Anyway, there we are. Instead of 21 sheep, there's now 31 sheep 
and three alpaca in this winter accommodation. So two, four, six, eight, ten, and three alpaca. Now all these ladies can join in. Okay, big flock of black sheep. There we go. You can see the hoggets are still smaller than the adult yews. Takes them about two years to get to their mature date from lambing, which is why I don't put hoggets in lamb or try not to put hoggets in lamb. I'm gonna write your feather. Look at her, she's carrying babies. Isn't that right? Good girl. Okay, there's gonna be a lot of pecking order stuff. You can see right there, Ebony is reestablishing pecking order again. Where does she fit in? Because there's constant readjustments. Whereas I have two people who just wanna have a scratch, head scratched. Well, yep. They're all having a conversation. Come on. Brindle, back here. Okay. Very happy sheep and alpaca. Hoggets. <laughs> A little bit. Go on. Come on, girls. So we now have a very large flock. There's definitely going to be some tussling. There's tussling happening up there. People are going to be battered into their place in the pecking order. There's going to be a lot of fighting today. The alpaca have just gone off. They're having a lovely time. They're saying, yay, out of that nasty shed. They, they were all in the shed for so long because they were shorn so late last year. If weather gets bad again, I will have to um, bring them in again but most of them are fine now. Their fleeces have grown enough. The alpaca and ebony will be the ones, the main ones I'll bring in if we get more frost because the alpaca fleeces are so short. There we go. Job done. Yay!